So I've been in the office all morning um, and uh, I'm glad I have. Today is not one of those days where you want a job where you work outside. Uh, it's about 11 o'clock now, but I am going to be going outside in about half an hour, three quarters an hour time because the Tour of Britain, which is the cycle race, is actually coming right past my office. Um, now, very fortunately, in that corner there, you see those things just there? They're those little camping chairs. <laughs> and with my bad knee, I'm not sure I can stand and watch a cycling race, but with a camping chair, I can. So I'm going to wander down. I'm going to take half hour out of my day, and then I'm going to go and see these bikes go, Yong! and that's it. I know it'll be brief, but at least I could say I saw Sir Bradley Wiggins and Mark Cavendish, Cavendish and people like that go past in the Tour of Britain. So I'm really looking forward to that. Although the weather is definitely not playing ball today. Um, you can just see the misty kind of mountains in the back, or well, the misty hills, mountains. <laughs> uh, in the background there, uh, it's been raining most of the morning, and I'm watching Twitter, and I'm seeing that the events they've got going on down at the start line, which is in Sidmouth, uh, my friend Andre Burton, who is like a world-class um, stunt bicycle rider. <sighs> God, I, that sounds middle-aged, doesn't it? I think he, he doesn't even ride a BMX. It's a mountain bike, but he does loads of cool stunts on it. He's an amazing guy, uh, world-class, as I say. So, But he's um, on Twitter. I've seen that he's struggling with the wind down there, and, of course, Sidmouth quite exposed as well. But um, yeah, going to go down and watch a little bit of cycling very briefly and then come, on, uh, come back up to the office and crack on with the rest of the day's work. Because after that, and I can say this because this won't go out until tomorrow, I'm off to a surprise, or this evening, off to a surprise 50th birthday party. That's when you know you're getting old when your friends turn 50. But I doubt I'm going to vlog anything there because it's, uh, you know, just close friends. So um, yeah, doubt we're going to show any of that. But um, yeah, I'm looking forward to seeing Nick's face when he walks up the stairs in the Holt in Honiton and realises there's about 12 people there that are going to buy him dinner. Should be a good night. was that I knew it was going to be that quick they kind of flew by um, there was a little breakaway group in front which I haven't shown you so there was four cyclists out in front but I didn't show you that it was for starters it was very undramatic uh, but more importantly someone stood in front of me decided to put their umbrella in the front of the way so I couldn't actually see what I was filming uh, thank you for that sir with your umbrella so um yeah done and dusted saw that uh, what I didn't show you, or what I didn't allow you to hear, was that I was talking to my friend Sanjay, who works in the solicitors downstairs, and uh, we were chatting away, which is why I thought I'd put the music over it, but um, I've arranged a game of squash. All I need to do now is get my knee better first. Oh yeah. Right, I can't remember the last time I left work at half past five. But tonight, I'm leaving work at half past five. I've got this surprise birthday party to go to tonight, so I want to get home, probably iron a shirt. Iron a shirt, that's all I need to do really. Yeah, I had a shower this morning. Probably don't need a shave. Nick's not gonna notice. Um, so yeah, off to that party tonight. As I said, probably won't be able to film that. But you know, if I get a chance, I will. But yeah, it's quite a novelty. Look, there's cars still in the car park, not just mine. And there, the solicitors. Half past five on a Friday. <gasps> if you watch this, solicitors downstairs. <laughs> You're normally all gone by half past five on a Friday. Let's be fair. I think it's good that you're there now. But you'll be gone in the next 10 minutes, guaranteed. Just to prove my point about the solicitors leaving in 10 minutes, there's only one car left there now, although Sanjay's here. That boy works hard. He's always late. He's here till seven o'clock most nights. But um, yeah, there you go. 
most of the solicitors are already gone and it's 10 minutes late. So I said I wouldn't vlog here, but I'm going to. And this is our little get together over here. A few people drinking over here. Oh, there's the wife, there's Susie, there's Phil, there's Joff. Sarah, can't work. Oh, hello. Getting abused from over the time. There's birthday boy. Hello. He's 50. Hey. Hey. He's back to front. Oh. 20, look, it's just your 20. I'll turn it around. I'll turn it around. <laughs> this is around. This is around. Around. <laughs> you're, No, you're two. <laughs> two. Yay. He wishes. And there's birthday girl's other half. Sarah! And yeah, yeah, we've had the main course. It's got to that point in the evening. Maybe we should quit while we're behind. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah, I can't see. Can't see a black old. Can I move the light? It's your old. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Come on! It's the joy of an iPhone, you know, these days. He's loving all this attention. It's like paparazzi, this is. Paparazzi.